Very noisy. Hey, this is not a spring chicken. We are on the way to the Sundance. Oh yeah, Sundance Film Festival in Utah. But meanwhile, can you tell we're on a road trip? So we're going through Vegas. But this is one of our favorite places to shoot. Oh, oh, I guess we better get to the news, huh? Okay. So meanwhile, we're going to bring Old Cam on with comments on the headlines of yeah. today. Yeah. Nigerian president and unions fell to strike a deal. Yeah, when the communists don't strike a deal with the communist unions, it means the president is on the way out. Oh, is that what that means? Yeah. And Iran warns of consequences if Arabs back oil sanctions. Yeah, you know, they're trying to figure out what the consequences are. They're going to stop the Straits of Hormuz. If they do that, the United States will blow them out of the water. What's happened is the, the Iranians have pushed things too far now because they know Obama wants a fight. And uh, and they think that Obama basically wants to keep the battle going on for a long time. But as of this morning, the Europeans are basically uh, okay. They put Obama in a bad position. Obama has to pick up the um, the pace on oil production in our country to make up for what's going to be lost from Iran, and he doesn't want to do that. And Nigeria, um, <laughs> Nigeria president and unions and talks without deal. I know. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Well, okay, churchgoers, a little influenced by Santorum endorsement. Well, yeah, because first of all, the, they're not going to elect somebody that's going to be a, you know, basically, uh, he's not what they want as president, folks. And Captain's conduct blasted as divers find more dead. Yeah, it's up to 11 now, and altogether, 16 crew members and 24 passengers missing, which means they're probably all, they're, everybody being found is in the flooded section. Oh, really? Yeah, we got a visitor watching Oh, us. you do have a visitor. It looks like somebody's hungry. Yeah, we got to you know. And rival see conservative vote. Oh, see split conservative vote and Huntsman out. Well, yeah, because, the, okay, the, the, uh, they said oh. that, uh, what's his name, Romney cannot lose no matter what because the party has decided that he's their person. Would, really? Yeah, we don't want to, and the puppy dog, he's going to have to go elsewhere. Yeah, Woodford to sue Olympus over firing and drop CEO bid. Yeah, because um, it, it just that that fund is basically it's a Japanese fund. It's a total disaster. An exclusive West Ready's oil plant in, in case of Iran crisis. Well, yeah, that's Obama has to start pumping, and he doesn't want to do that. That basically, they said if this happens, Obama loses the left on his. And he's also smelling Monty now. I would guess so. Texas teen deported to Columbia reunites with mom. Isn't that amazing? They, they basically illegally deported an American citizen to a foreign country, and now they're trying to figure out how, and a, and a teenager, too. I mean, they're just in so much trouble, it's unbelievable, the TSA. And all but conceding New Hampshire, Romney's rivals look to South Carolina. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's old news. That's really bright, isn't it? Okay, the rivals cannot take South Carolina. They're going to split the vote up massively. I know, kids, you have not missed a meal either, so I can tell that. I know. You're before one of the other houses around here. And Nation adds 200,000 jobs in December hiring surge. No, they didn't. It's all, um, they, they basically said it's all uh, temporary hiring is what it is, so. And death toll among U.S. pedestrians wearing headphones triples. I know. Which uh, is because they can't hear what's being done. So that's one of the things. It's like if you're out on the road and stuff. I don't. It's like yeah. I don't sit there and wear headphones. And fire claims one of the world's oldest cypress trees in Florida. If somebody set fire to a tree. I mean, basically every time. Are you, are you serious? They, do it. They, they, they have no respect for history, so they destroy it. And number of missing in Italian cruise disaster raised to 29. Yeah, which they, they, we get, okay, there's no two, there's no consensus uh, about, because I figure you should add the 16 crew members that can't be found to the list also. Oh, really? And Tanker begins fuel transfer to iced in Alaska okay, town. I'm telling this. They get, okay, Nome is a major city in Alaska, folks. There is the Alaska Highway. They fly things in. There's a military base, you know, Subic Bay is right around the thing, you know. I, I've been I've been to the military bases. They have no problem. We have icebreakers, but they're trying to make it look like it's a really big deal. Well, now, well, if they didn't deliver it by, a by, by April, they'll be out of fuel. Well, considering it's getting ready to be the warm part of the year for them, I don't think they worry about it a whole lot. And Venezuela sends Miami consulate personnel home. Oh, yeah, because uh, they're basically, uh, Hugo Chavez is basically having his people bounce out of the country. Oh, are you serious? Well, because he's dealing, he's basically uh, dealing with Iran and their sanctions against Iran. 
see the doggy can smell Bonte on you too. And five-story building in Beirut collapses and kills 25. No, they think the building just don't collapse. They think it was probably a bomb set it down. Oh, something doesn't sound right on that. What yeah. do you think? And questions remain over where exactly Russian Mars probe fell. They still have no idea. They're now claiming the United States brought it down with what? radar. They said that they scanned it with their radar, uh, and it basically knocked the guidance system out. And Thai police sees explosives and charged Lebanese man. Oh, well, yeah, another Muslim, so. Lots of stuff going on. And S&P downgrades European bailout fund and Greece pressured. Well, yeah, and, and the market's going up today on on that, 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 that the bailout fund is a failure. They're not doing anything in Europe to fix the problem. And China has basically hit the 10th straight quarter of a down market, which means... China is not growing like, they, they said the Chinese government is getting ready to print more money to solve the problem. Did they take lessons from the United States? They're listening to Obama. That's uh -huh. how you solve the problem is if you, you can't make, if you, you basically funnel money that's worthless and nothing into your economy. Mm. And Santorum, trim Social Security now, even if painful. Well, somebody's got to trim it sometime, folks. The Social Security is a dead fund because the feds are taking so much money out of it. So. And a hot air balloon burst into flames in New Zealand, and 11 are dead. I don't know why an idiot would want to go in a hot air balloon, because it, you got to, you know, if, it, it, it can blow, it can burn up. You know, you take a balloon that's basically filled with helium and go up, at least it comes down slowly. And Giffords arrives in Tucson for shooting ceremonies. I know. I mean, that, that basically the Democrats are trotting that woman out. They're thinking of having a run for Senator Kyle's seat of all. Are you serious? I know. Basically, she doesn't have much of a clue where she's at in this world, and but she she looks good, but she basically has to have handlers with her all the time. So, uh, and government defense core of health care overhaul. Well, no, they said it. Uh, okay, the way it works is that they'll probably find against Obama's health care, but they'll leave the taxes. Oh, really? Which is what Obama always wanted. He wanted a new tax on people. He said, well, if you're going to get taxed, you might as well have the health care. But you don't have the health care no matter what. So. Well, it's, uh, I know, the he just wanted the tax. He just wanted the tax. Just thought, like when Jerry Brown yesterday admitted that, they, that the cap and trade is simply another tax, he said, we're going to use that money to help pay for the bills that we can no longer pay for. Yeah, all in the name of health care and uh, but cap and trade. Yeah, yeah right. An electrical socket concept forcibly ejects plugs of inactive appliances and devices. I know, but that's ridiculous, folks. You don't, I mean, what idiot dreamed up a thing that, that unplugs you? Can you imagine that in a house, it just pops all the plugs out of your house? Some of these things, they're supposed to be on because they got clocks in them and things like that. Yeah, and old Cam has been adopted. The, the little doctor, he's sitting down at your feet. I know, he's at my feet. He knows a veterinarian when he sees one. He's just sitting down. I mean, he's not, this, okay, they got a sign that says abandoning dog. This dog has not been mistreated. That dog has not been and mistreated, he's not and he's very healthy. Yeah, he's probably from one of the houses. He's clean, there. too. I mean, he is, yeah. But you don't ever touch a dog that, and out like this because you got no idea what's going to happen. Bonobo ape lights campfire and cooks hamburgers. I know. So, so what is that? I have no clue what that one means. That one's sort of a... Okay, we just picked these things up from the news wires, folks. So. And a Monty Bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Uh, okay. Often dogs that look abandoned aren't abandoned. They're just looking for a handout. Oh, you mean like Monty could always use another. Monty is always starving. <laughs> even though her tummy is dragging on the ground. <laughs> 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 <